Okay, my friends, I'm going to show you how to clean the filter. And once again, thanks a lot. I so appreciate it. So you come over to the corner of my yard, right by Brother Lyman's house, right by the nice fire hydrant there and our mailboxes. And so you grab the one that's uh, the second one away from there. And on the lift there, you pull that up. And you just come in and you're going to switch this to where it's 90 degrees. It's like it goes right down into the dirt. So once, once you've turned the valve, and uh, it takes a little bit sometimes for the, the drain valve to drain off. And if you can't get it, you could let some pressure off with this cap valve. But then you're gonna go and you're gonna take this, and that's the filter. And it looks like it's got all kinds of junk that I don't normally see in here. I think this stuff is probably glue and stuff from the system. And normally this thing is held tight like this but and that holds these little discs together. And then we're gonna take it over to the hose. But while we're here, I'll show you, just you just do that. It doesn't come off, it holds that, but it allows these discs to rotate freely. And we're just gonna be, basically take the hose out there and spray this all off and get this gunk off there. So, all right, let's go. So I've got, I've got, I've got a hose in the front yard. So you turn that, I've already had it on. You come over here. this much instruction Steve but I know how to do this but I like to get this going nice like that done with that you're going to put it together and then turn this thing clockwise so it's now tight again and then we're going to go put it back in we're just going to simply put it in there's no well i guess let's see i think there looks like one's more of a female side than the other so it's female side in first and then this one will just fit inside the top you just basically put that in You simply move the sprinkler valve back and then you're done. Thank you. Thanks again.